it's very rare that I sit alongside such an intelligent and such a uh, sense of humor that uh, Governor Sununu has. So I'm so happy to introduce him also. You left out warm and kind. Warm and kind. <laughs> warm and kind are not necessarily the first words that come to mind when most voters think of former New Hampshire Governor John Sununu. Thank you very much. He is a fierce supporter of Mitt Romney and prone to going rogue, often saying things the scripted Romney campaign can't or won't. When he spoke to New Jersey delegates on Tuesday morning, he didn't pull any punches. That's what the Obama administration and the Obama campaign is. They are either the dumbest people in the world and can't read, or they are out and out the most dishonest campaigners I've ever seen. About six weeks ago, on a conference call with reporters, he caused some trouble for the Romney campaign with these comments, though he later apologized. I wish this president would learn how to be an American. But it's that very willingness in his un-PC spunk that gets the crowd fired up here at the convention. You guys are great. Thank you very much. And thank you for being great Republicans. Bye-bye. He's become something of a celebrity here, getting mobbed by convention goers nearly everywhere he goes. Your reception here has been crazy. Nice to see, to see you here. Again. In elevators, in restaurants, in Radio Row. People are nice. The Romney campaign notoriously scripted, and you are known for notoriously going off script. They know I'm the crazy uncle of the campaign. and. Uh, as long as I'm 90% right, I guess they're happy. So I've, I've tried to keep it closer to 99.9. .9. People have been coming up to you and saying, thank you for speaking the truth. Thank you for not yeah. being politically correct. Sort of what is the un-PC message you would like the to get? The un-PC message is, this president is a fraud. This president never did anything in his life and has done nothing as president. And, and somehow it's the same as the emperor has no clothes story. And it's my job to point out that he's a fraud. While I spoke to him, even the press descended en masse to get in on the fun, but we were able to drag him away for a few more questions. Do you think you've ever gone too far? Actually, I don't. Even when I had to apologize uh, for the comment about President Obama needing to learn how to be an American, that was in the context of, of um, the American formula for job creation. Uh, if there wasn't such paranoia, both in the Obama White House and the Romney campaign about uh, the birther issue. I wouldn't have had to apologize, but I didn't want to, to be misconstrued as being related to that. Mm -hmm. and so I did apologize and moved on to the most important subject, which was we got to create jobs. 